Hi there, and thanks for joining us here at Philip Capital Market Watch. I'm Kervin, securities dealer from Philip CFD. Today, we'll be looking at the US-Turkey impasse and how escalating economic tensions are playing out in the region and the world. With soured ties between the US and Turkey, we have in recent weeks seen the Turkish lira spot plunge against the dollar. This, coupled with Turkey's mounting unhedged dollar and euro denominated debts, results in the country struggling to meet external financing needs. There is also a risk of contagion as we see Argentine, Spanish, Italian and French banks having sizable exposure to Turkish debt. The US-Turkey spat arose from a confluence of events, including US demanding the release of US pastor Andrew Brunson, who was detained by Turkey in 2016 for alleged involvement in an attempted coup. This, in tandem with security concerns on a US-Turkey fighter jet deal and a subsequent Russian missile defense systems agreement, prompted the Trump administration to press Turkey on some form of recourse. With Turkish President Rajiv Tayyip Erdogan defied US demands, American President Donald Trump decided to impose sanctions and tariffs on Turkey. Since August 8, we have seen sharp and consistent decline in the lira against the dollar. The lira's tumbling adds to existing headwinds faced by emerging markets. With China's economy slowing, along with the Sino-US escalating trade war, investor sentiment has taken a turn for the worse, resulting in high multi-asset volatility in emerging markets. In summary, we do expect that if the crisis is not contained and managed, we will face the risk of contagion where the spillover effect will negatively impact multiple countries and regions. Therefore, it is crucial that the Turkish government acts quickly to convince markets that the situation can be controlled. So as investors, what can you do during such times? One thing is to look towards a value, value in Europe and emerging markets via exchange-traded funds like VGK and EEM, or consider hedging existing Turkish exposure via safe haven assets using contract for differences CFDs. That's all for Philip Capital's Market Watch this week. Do remember to like and follow us on social media and subscribe to us on YouTube. Also, tell us what you think. What hedging strategies would you use during uncertain times? Leave your comments. Thanks for joining us and see you soon.